Hey everyone, today we are going to go over the update patch 21 notes that was released of August 4th, 2020. Let's just jump straight ahead and see what exploits were fixed and what is new with this update. Well, with this update, the exploits that addressed an exploit allowing players to stack multiple traps, as I'm sure most of you are aware that the boards were stackable before, and then there was a way of doing it afterwards which involved using the other uh, floor trap to destroy that and then stack it afterwards and so forth. Now, the next exploit that was fixed was an exploit related to scrapping Assaultron helmets. Now, I was aware of this one before. I never made a video on it, but essentially if you had super or duper, I believe, and another perk, you could essentially scrap uh, Assaultron helmets and craft them. I could be wrong on it, but there is some sort of steps that was generally like that. I, I wasn't really caring for it, so I didn't take a good look at it, but that exploit has been fixed. Onto the next exploit that was fixed. There was an exploit that was fixed resulting from reviving another player under a certain circumstance. I'm not sure what that was. Uh, maybe you guys are aware. If you could let me know, let me know down below because I'm not sure what exploit that was unless it was some sort of god mode on the side. But anyways, on the next exploit, there was an exploit that allowed bows to fire much faster than intended. And I'm pretty sure this involved using your pit boy and getting out of it real quickly or something like that. And that's how you were able to to fire the bow quickly and I guess they fixed that uh, it doesn't seem like a big deal it just seems strange that they don't fix things like the reputation glitch that is something really really big but hey I guess they missed out on this one big news update with the ammo converter they have received a lot of feedback from us and so this is what they've added you can now buy and sell 10 times and 100 times the normal amount of ammo so that you can exchange larger stacks more quickly not only that they've incorporated the buying and selling directly into the terminal page for each ammo type which means that you will have fewer screen clicks to go through or button clicks to go through depending on if you're on console and that is pretty much it with it and you get the upped maximum amount of ammo points you can store from 2,000 to 100,000 so that's awesome as well and additionally with this update the legendary loot daily quest and events have had their legendary loot rewards updated to include the additional items so now you can receive the fixer legendary the secret service armor legendary and others as long as you've basically have had the plans learned this is good news so now you no longer need to take your scripts mainly to Prevere and get the fixer or whichever one you want that way so that's really cool let's go to the colossal problem today update brings the new public event a colossal problem to the game however we are still making some performance tweaks and doing additional testing before we enable the event we are planning to make a colossal problem available with the following update in the next couple of weeks so there you have it guys I'm not gonna go too hardcore in this they just add some additional information we won't begin the colossal problem this week uh, hopefully next or the next two weeks we'll get it who knows this thing has been pushed a little bit further on than I'm sure they intended so that is what's going on and additionally we have meat week going on so make sure you prepare for that is a seasonal event and it's returning to Appalachia this month on August 18th to the 24th if you haven't taken a, a part of this event in the past do it now you will be able to just get a nice event going on myself I have not participated in this one I, I don't even think I did with the flash operate either so there you have it uh, but, but participate in the event have fun guys this is it with all the updates in the patch notes and whatnot i'm sure there's a lot more i'll leave the link down below if you guys want to go more in depth into it but i'm just here to tell you the exploits some cool stuff that's going on and what's been fixed uh with that being said i hope all you guys are having a great day out there in the good old world and i'm gonna just head out happy glitching peace